Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm so glad to be here with you today. I have a thrift haul video, of course. <laughs> this one is from Goodwill. Now, this is the same day as the video before this one, which is why I have on the same clothes and the same hairdo. Yes, I do shower. Uh, <laughs> Uh, I decided to just film two videos and knock them out. So, for anyone who's new here, thank you so much for clicking on my video. I'm Dee, and I'm an avid uh, thrifter and reseller. I do uh, thrift haul videos, shop-alongs, uh, crafts and upcycle videos. Um, what else do I do? Sometimes I do cooking and baking. Sometimes. I do a, a little bit of everything on this channel. So if that sounds good to you, then please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Now, let's get into this thrift haul. I got some really great items today, I think. Uh, and I spent $116. $116. Doll hairs. Holy shizzle. All right, with that being said, let's get into it. I'm just going to start with the boring pieces first. I got this wood plaque to uh, do, you know, an upcycle on. I'm not sure what I will put on this, but, uh, you know, like I said, I never know until I sit down at my craft table and go through my things and uh, just play around with what I have and see what I can come up with. So I picked that up. I don't know where I'm going to put this stuff. Let me, here, let me put it on this chair that's behind me. Oh my God, it's stuck. I'm stuck. Get over there. <laughs> Both legs were intertwined. There, go over there. Look what I found, guys! <laughs> More really kids. My friends love when I do my um my upcycles on my rolling pins. So I did find another one. However, this one is spoken for by my friend Corrine. She asked me to make her one with some kind of chicken, you know. Um design. So, this one is spoken for. I found this enamel, blue speckled enamel ladle. How cute is that? I love enamelware. I love it. This would look so cute. I might even, I might even do a little something with this. I'm not sure. Unless somebody wants it before I get my hands on it. <laughs> I found these two. These are beautiful and they're in perfect condition. Uh, these two pretty toothpick holders. They may be crystal. This one feels, this one, I don't know. They're both about, they're both heavy but no chips, cracks, or flea bites on them either, so that's a big plus. I got this um, Avon Light Up Christmas Tree. Now, when I brought it home, I put the batteries in it, and one of the lights lit up, which was the green one, but I just turned the switch on, and now all of these are blown out. So you will have to replace the um, the bulbs, but it does work. And it's beautiful. Or if you wanted to, you could just put fairy lights in there. You know, whatever, whatever your little heart desires. But it's so pretty. And this is glass. The tree itself is glass, but the star in the base are plastic. Sorry, I just moved my camera. 
I got this for me because for some reason, I can't remember what the hell I did with my watering can. I, it just disappeared into thin air. I have not been able to find it since before Christmas. So I found this one and it's cobalt blue. So guess what? It's mine. <laughs> I need a watering can. Um, let's see. I got this bench, this little bench, but I'm going to repaint it. Now, I'm going to leave this, this, you know, this here the way it is. I am just going to repaint the sides and the top. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to put on it yet, but I mean... I could not resist. I had to pick this up. So I did. <laughs> it's a great piece. Okay, I got these two. These are brand new Christmas towels. How beautiful are these towels? I mean, they're just uh, decor in themselves. When I first saw them in the bag, I thought it was an apron. And then I opened it up and I'm like, oh, how pretty. It's a set of towels. Yes. Um, I did get this for me. These are just um, little note cards. God bless my special friends. Very cute. They're Hallmark. There's eight um, cards and eight envelopes. Okay, where do I want to go next? Hmm. We're going to go right here. <laughs> Today I am partaking in my um, sparkling peach water. It is so refreshing. They sell it at Aldi and they also sell it at Walmart. I love the peach. Okay. Okay. I got two gorgeous Virgin Mary pieces. This one is a planter. And it is just gorgeous. It does have some discoloration and crazing because it is old. Now it isn't marked. There's the inside of the planter. Um, I don't know who makes her but it's just beautiful. I I just love it. And then I got this one. And she is musical. I don't know what song. Now it says on here, wait, there's something on here. Hold on. Oh shoot. I don't want to take that off because it's going to rip off the, um, San Francisco Music Box Company, made in Taiwan. I have no idea. It's beautiful though. It's that pretty satin glaze. Just beautiful. I just love religious pieces. All right, next I found, these are Pioneer Woman. These are like Jadeite, but they're a little different in color. It says unique color variations. They're cereal bowls. I'm sorry, I need a much bigger bowl than that for my cereal, okay. Heck yeah, this would be more, 
um, for maybe a couple scoops of ice cream or something. But then again, I would use bigger bowls than this for my ice cream too. <laughs> but I loved the color, which is why I grabbed them. These are very cool. Very, very cool. Um, I got this. This is a, a pottery. It's USA teapot. And I just loved the color variation on that. How cute is this? There's the inside. And then these little nubs go in there. And how cute is this? I love it. And you might be able to see it says USA there. USA. I got some signs uh, that I planned on doing thrift flips on or upcycles, whatever you would like to call it. Got this one. It is with, what? It is well within my soul. But I would um, sand this off and do something else on here. Um, and it's got nice hangers on there. So we got that piece. And I'm going to set this over here because, oh my back. Oh, okay. Then I got this one also to uh, flip. It's a dry erase board. However, I am going to paint over this with chalk paint and do something else on here. Mm -hmm. I don't really need a board to tell me the things that I need to do. Trust me, I know what I have to do. There just ain't enough hours in the day to get her done. This is really, really cute. <laughs> Somebody might want this, so I may not even get a chance to do anything with it. This is a Hobby Lobby piece. Don't wake the bear. <laughs> oh my gosh. If you have a cabin or a cottage or, you know, you have a, you know, rustic decor, this is perfect. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love it. <laughs> that is adorable. <laughs> okay, um, I did get this. Uh, I knew it was broken. It's, it's a, it, had, it had an easel back on it. Um, but as you could see, I wish I could read the label on there. It is broken. So I planned on perhaps I can, I'm going to put some way to hang it. And, you know, somebody could put a hanger on it and, and hang it on the wall. Or they could use it as a dresser tray or a perfume tray. But my thoughts were to do a picture inside of here, something. So I'm not quite sure exactly what I will do with it. But I knew I had to have it. <laughs> so there is that piece. Then I got this vintage jewelry box. It's made by Melly, M-E-L-E. -E. And this is, it is filthy. I have to clean this. I'm going to have to go get my bottle of crud cutter and clean it up. But let me open it and show you. It's, look at how pretty. It's in good condition considering, look at that. Beautiful pink satin and like uh, velour, pink velour. 
Absolutely. So I just gotta, I just gotta clean her up. I also found this Vera Bradley. I think you could either put an iPad in here or a Bible. Um, I'm not quite sure because it only opens up this far. So I'm thinking you could put either one of those things in here. Beautiful. Look how cute. It's in fantastic condition. Then I got this for myself to keep track of all my business stuff. Stranger Things. I can't wait for the final season. Oh my gosh, it should be out in July, I think. And then no more. But I got that. And I also got myself these two um, pads of... Um, Scrapbook paper, hello. This one has some beautiful designs in it. Look at, let me see if I can show you. Yeah, that's not going to work. They look vintage. Those are all the different patterns. So $7.99 and then 25% off of that is $5.49. And it's regularly $22. So thank you. This one did not have an actual price on it. I did not see a price on it. But um, it's, it's never been used, but it's got all these pretty patterns. So I got that one. These are all the different patterns. Very pretty. All right. I have saved the best items for last. This is like a peachy, almost like um, a peachy root beer, amber color. A little nappy. Perfect condition. Look at this. I'm calling it a celery dish. This is Germany. Oh my God. Look at the colors on that. And it is in perfect condition, guys. There's no cracks, no chips, no flea bites. Let's see if I could get you to see the back stamp on there. This is absolutely stunning. And boy, did I pay up for it. Trust me. Then I got this pretty pansy plate. This is um, Bavaria. I love when they do the little gold peaks like little points. It just adds a little something, something. This is beautiful. Look at this one. This one is also Bavaria. Wait a minute. Am I lying? No, I'm not. It is Bavaria. Oh, my God. That is just gorgeous. And the best one, this is RS Germany. Oh, look at this beautiful piece, you guys. OMG. 
and it's got an iridescence to it. Oh my word. Look at those flowers. Oh. Mm -hmm. So, $116 later. Let me know what you guys think in the in the comments below. I um <laughs> Oh, I got my job cut out for me anymore. Let me tell you. I do the best I can though. Thank God I learned how to do some thrift flips and some different things to add into my sales. Well, guys, I hope you did enjoy the video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. I'm almost at 13,000. Gee, it seems like it's been forever. I don't know. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye for now. Hello, everyone. Claude and Lauberge here. Now that you've tried on your fancy hose, you must splash yourself with the Gina Tartum powder. Fancy schmancy, y'all.